What's up traders, Matt from the Trade Brigade here doing a technical analysis on ticker symbol TSLA for Tesla Inc. On the left hand side we're looking at the daily time frame and on the right hand side we have the 30 minute intraday time frame. This is something that I watch very closely on an intraday basis so the chart is already marked up and in the weekly watch this video I put out on my main channel we were essentially watching for the breakout of this level here 714 to take us into the next major resistance 724 hoping for some consolidation underneath and then the breakout to unlock the door to 7. But as of today's close, you can see that things are starting to develop and unfold a little bit quicker than we expected. Clearly, the 714 break already happened. You can see that from a 30 minute intraday perspective. There it was earlier on in the day, straight up to our next resistance, some consolidation, and then a very strong close. What I want to do is just focus on that close actually through the lens of the Fibonacci tools. If we do something like this, go from here to the first uh, essential high before the pullback, you can see that the 38.2 was respected. The very next candle after we closed closed underneath, reclaimed it to the upside. So I wouldn't call that a uh, tough violation of that area here. I would say it held up quite well. In terms of the actual close though, if we go from the low of the entire move up to the high of the entire move, you can clearly see there was no end of day pullback. We closed essentially right at the highs here. So this to me strikes me as a very bullish close, especially given the fact that from the daily perspective, we have already taken out this area of resistance here around 724.40, 7.25 if you like rounding up and using nice whole numbers. So that just simply puts into play the next target overhead here at 750. If you're not already long Tesla from today's session, then basically what you're gonna be watching for is any sort of hold of this on a pullback. So let's go ahead and map that area in here. It's going to be any sort of hold of 722, any consolidation up here, fine. And then as soon as you see a bullish pattern, you're looking for the breakout over today's high, which was a pressure cooker top into the end of the day here at 731. So very clear uh, area of consolidation, very clear rules here that we have with a target overhead. If we get the break of 731, target is 750. And based on the range and uh, volatility in Tesla, I do imagine it could do that all in one day. If it really gets going and sees more upside, the next major area that I'm seeing would be about 780. $30 higher from that target, which we would expect to hit tomorrow, should there be momentum continuation. So to the downside, if we do violate 722, I would argue be patient, right? What we would essentially be doing is falling back into this prior four day balance range. And again, I would be very patient, wait to see how the dust settles and then reevaluate once we put in some more market structure. So those are my thoughts here on Tesla. I do think we're going to see bullish continuation. Again, don't just jump in as a blind buyer. Please wait for some type of bullish setup to form. And then as we know that 750 is going to be the overhead target. If you enjoyed today's video, if you uh, learned something new, let me know down below in the comment section or by giving the video a thumbs up. Don't forget our main channel is linked in the description. And all of that being said, I wish you a green trading week.